Construction season is right around the corner and we're bound to see plenty of digging and detours, but a Hastings company wants people to develop an understanding of what heavy equipment operators go through every day. In this week's Finding Minnesota, John Lordson takes us to the extreme sandbox for 26 tons of fun. Admit it, when you see a construction site, you kind of wonder what it'd be like to sit in the driver's seat of a mega machine. Randy Stinger had that exact same thought. A lot of people ask me how I came up with the idea and they think I was a contractor and I'm like, nope, I'm just a big kid at heart. I may say hands off. Ten years ago, he turned his idea into extreme sandbox in Hastings. We have excavators, bulldozers, wheel loaders, mini excavators. I get to dig in the dirt. I, I play for a living. It's a sort of, if you build it, they will come mentality. But in this case, it's you that's doing the building. I'd say there's very few places in the world where you can go on and experience heavy equipment. Welcome to Extreme Sandbox. After watching a safety video, it's time to climb into a 26-ton excavator where instructor Adam Johnson and I communicate by headset. Up we go. I don't want to get fired on the first day. That's the worst, right? Yeah. It's a good first scoop. Right hand to the right to dump it out. Get out of here, dirt. It's a bucket list item for many visitors. With authority. As they pile on the fun. One, two, three. <laughs> now give me a victory spin. Swing around go. a couple of times. There we go. Yeah! yeah. This is fun. I'm an excellent spinner. There's an excavator obstacle course where cars occasionally need to be put in their place. This is a nice looking car. It's too bad it had to end this way, huh? <laughs> this isn't your old beater, is it, Adam? The car gets picked up like it's nothing. And after a quick spin, it's gently placed back on the ground. Look at that. Like putting the baby to bed. You can start bump up your speed a little bit with that left. The bulldozer has an obstacle course of its own. Right about there. You make a ramp and eventually get to test your balance. Just like a teeter totter. A 21 ton teeter totter. Keep going. Yeah. Ooh, that is cool. My kids want a swing set, and I think I'll just get them one of these. A heavy duty thrill. But at the end of the day, people leave with a new appreciation for what construction crews are doing. That's kind of cool that we're able to give that back to the trades. Yeah. As a father, I've also seen this skills gap is real in high schools and really trying to educate the younger generations that there's some great trades out there. There's some hands-on careers out there. In Dakota County, John Lordson, WCCO 4 News. And the people at Extreme Sandbox tell us anywhere from 30 to 40 percent of their customers are women, and they typically do better than men because they are better listeners. Surprise, surprise. The company caters to corporate team building, but anyone is welcome to make a reservation. For more information on packages and pricing, we've provided a link on our website, WCCO.com. And can you think of a person or place John should know about? Send him your Finding Minnesota ideas at WCCO.com links.